We could not understand where this little girl had come from on the streets of the city. She was always hungry and shaking from the cold, but she would not even try to get close to people and would run away from men. We started asking locals about the dog. Some of them said that she had owners, but it was a dysfunctional family, others that she lived with an old grandmother who had been ill lately. The girl was wearing a collar, which became too small for her and literally cut into her skin. It was impossible to catch the doggie. She did not trust people, shunned strangers. Even to the food we brought him, the dog would not come near the food until we were a decent distance away. She ate as if she did not hope that she would have another opportunity to satisfy her hunger. We managed to catch her only once, but that day we finally managed to take off her collar, because of which she was already breathing with difficulty. At first the dog sometimes ran into the entrance to warm up, but after that he stopped. A man who had no fixed abode lived not far from the house. The man abused the dog and it became afraid to come close to the house. We realized that the dog's previous owners had abused it a lot. She was afraid of people and everything connected with them. One of the local dog owners told us that she had seen the little girl being severely beaten by a man. After a while, the dog took a walk, and the male dog started following her. Local residents did not like this picture. Many blamed the dog living in their yard and threatened to deal with it. We tried to find a foster home for the dog, but in our city it is difficult to find one, and once again we were faced with the fact that there were no places anywhere. We were very afraid that something might happen to the dog. Such a beautiful little girl had all chances to find a family in time. To begin with, we decided to sterilize the dog to protect it from a pack of street dogs. That day when we started to realize our plan, it was cold. Rain was pouring from the sky, which froze before it reached the ground. The doggy was sitting outside in the rain with nowhere to go. We managed to bait the girl with food and put a collar on her. Scared that we would hurt her, the dog started whining loudly, but after a while she realized that she was safe and calmed down. We named our new dog Terry.